I'm not allowed. Uh, excuse me, sir. May, may I just talk, talk to you? You say I'm not allowed? Okay, he'll be right with you, okay? My fiance is here. She in the emergency room. What's her name? Shameen. So I can't even visit her. Okay, let me say if you're... So I, I didn't come today to be a patient. I told you. Let me get my stuff out of here. They told me I, I can't be seen. I mean, I can't come in. I'm not allowed in. I told you. I fell in 21 here. Hurt myself. My lawyer withdraw in December uh, 23. Fell in 21. See, he on the phone. I got videos of them. They followed me around to my primary office. These guards right here. And now today is January. It's 11.38 a.m. Wednesday, January 17, 2024. And he's telling me I can't come to see my lady. The ambulance came last night, uh, yesterday morning at 8, and brung her here. So I stayed away all this time. And then she texted me this morning and told me to come. Here I am. And that was 8 o'clock. It's 11. 38. See? I even waited like three more hours. So my name is Walter McNeil, Poison Eat Your Wolf. Yep. Go ahead, sir. What's up, buddy? How you doing? Emergency? Yeah, I'm just picking somebody up. And I was So, so they told me that I'm not allowed to no Nazareth, no Mid Atlantics, no I'm Mercy. No, I'm sharing with you. That's that's what they they told. Talk to you when you get on this video. But, but, sir, this is for my purpose, sir. I'm not trying to disrespect you or nothing. I understand that. I respect you. You, you got to respect that. So, we're not recording them or nothing. You want me now? So, the thing is, I'm at here at Nazareth Hospital. They had probably since 2021. No, you're not allowed in here. I told you. Well, why? You got, you got served. You're not allowed in any Trinity that I'm assuming. Uh, I don't know nothing about it, but you're not allowed here. But I didn't do nothing, sir. You didn't do nothing, what, today? At all, period. Well, well, you did something. That's why you got banned from here. And that's and why you, you followed me to my primary. Uh, well, you're not allowed back there either, so... And why is that? Because you followed me there. I don't got nothing to do with your primary doctor. Why do you give money you, to you? You really do. What May I have your name then? Since I'm Mr. not here. Mr. Baker, Mr. Baker. I can't see it, sir, please. Mr. Baker, you're not the police. I'm going to have to get you I don't have name. to be a police. You're not allowed But you just here. told me I can't come here right. well, and my fiancé here? No, you know, I, I, don't know that. I don't know that. I don't know that. I gave it to you. So they told me I can't come here, right? Of course, come on. For what? You got, they served the chief there. For what? They sent the chief out. I don't know why. They didn't send nothing to my house. Here. They served me there, but for I what? Know. I ain't got nothing to do with it. Because you was around there at my primary office, sir. <clears throat> and because you was at my primary office, they terminated me. Like you said. Who terminated That's what I want to know. But the hospital security guards gave me the paperwork, but ain't nobody else gave me paperwork. Right, well, and guess what? My primary never told me I was right, terminated. Well, you're to play the yeah, role yeah. Now, you no, I'm playing the face. smart role because why? I told you I'm a sue this hospital. I, I don't care. You can sue the whole world for I'm concerned. I right. got nothing to do with right. me. You're not allowed here. Right. Period. All right. I understand that. All right. That's all. Don't make my job hard. I'm just doing my you, job. You've been making your job hard. How is that? Because I've been a patient here. I had smoked with this place since 21. I fell and hurt myself. And I keep telling you that. Mm. And I had my lawyer at court that withdraw. But out of all y'all, he the nicest man. Right. Hey, sir, thank you for letting me at least come in there. That's why I'm here because he told me to come around. And he was here that day when I got served. And he was at my primary too. Right. Matter of fact, y'all two was in a, in a, in a, in a uh, fire escape. Yeah, yeah, so let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. You always been a man with me. True? And, and say true? Vice versa, but you always been a man with me, right? What's your question? Here go my question. Why was you and you at my primary office in the fire escape but before the fire escape I seen him downstairs right, and then one more thing I was an hour late so y'all was there 
And I was an hour late in a right. fire you escape. You something that happened a year ago. It wasn't a year. It was only six months ago. All right, well, to me, that's a year ago because you're bringing up old stuff. They ain't got nothing to do with it. It ain't that old. Two years ain't passed. It's, it's a statute of limitations. That didn't pass yet. nothing to do with it. You're not allowed on the property. But you still ain't answer my question. you always been mad with me. Why was you and him in a fire escape? Because you constantly come here causing problems. And, and I was an hour and I was an hour late. You're going to ask me that. I was an hour late. Question. I'm trying to, but you're interrupting me. Go ahead. I don't want to interrupt. I, I, I'm done talking. All right. I just thank let you. you know what it is. Thank you're you. You're not allowed here. All right. And I say I am. All right. Well. See, eventually we're going to get to the judge, like I told you. Oh, well. Well, you're going to do what you're going to do. My other half man. So we can play Denzel, John Q. I ain't going nowhere. I'm gonna do something. You can call the cops. You make my job hard. Ain't making your job hard. I'm a patient. I'm a patient and no hospital. How are you a patient when you're not even allowed in hospital? I'm totally disabled. Thanks to Mr. Richard Berger, my primary office that you was at. Told you. You're king of the front. And guess what? He diagnosed me as it's both. I'm gonna try to protect myself from people. I gotta protect myself from myself because know why I'm limited, my balance all. So you're right, it's for a lot of things. And thanks to therapy. All right, step to the side. I will, sir, because you have other people coming in. All right, dropping our food or this one? Yes. Who is the fourth? I'm going into the... Oh, all right, go ahead. You see, all the other hospitals are doing this to me since, who knows? I say 15. And 21 Nazareth was the nicest hospital. Told me I got five damage nerves, five bolting discs, five hernia discs. Yes, sir, I got discs in my neck and back. They're the ones that told me that. They told me my trapezius is, hey, there you go. Hey, sir, you the one that served me. How you doing, sir? So since you served me, and we being a man, I'll calm it down because you have people around. Okay. Thank you, sir. Okay. Thank you, sir. Okay. Can you get this from mental health? Thank you. You can record any No, 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 no. I can you record. Sure about this, okay? Hold on, sir. Hold Police on, sir. are coming. Oh, so thank you, you sir. Thank you, sir. Wait for them there, okay? Well, you're right Hold about on. that. But you said you'll be a man. May I talk to you, sir? May I just talk to you, please? Can you just hear me out? Ma'am, can you just hear me out? Now, you never did nothing to me. I fell here in 21. The water was coming from that vent, and I have a civil on it. And I went to court recently, and my lawyer withdrew the fourth one. That's one out the way. My wife was here June 3rd, or maybe the 7th, but she was here six months ago, and I came and just ask for someone that I could talk to to report this, like I want to do now. May I see someone besides security so I could talk to and we can get did a good understanding? Huh? You, did you say she fell? Who fell? Or was she here? I fell. And my lawyer withdrew my fourth one. Okay. But I'm still able to get a lawyer. That ain't no problem. The problem is they took care of me. They let me know what I had and what I got. And they're the ones that told me Switched insurance from Edna to Health Partners. In 21, I did all that. And they told me that I would have a pain management, sir. Mr. Richard Berger, I'm in pain management now, sir. And all this is because I was on Percocets. And they the ones that told me to come to them. They helped me out. And all I did with my steps. So whenever I have something new and I come report it to them, they bring up the old. You can't do that. And one more thing. They, they just don't bring up the old. They don't even treat the new. So since they don't treat the old... For instance, real short. If I come right now with a new situation, that means acute and short, they terms right away. They gonna tell me ain't nothing wrong. I go away and try to heal myself. Next thing you know, I'm hurting, and now I come back. You know what they told me? They tell me chronic pains. But I came to you when it was acute. So when I come back with something new, this is, this is, you want to bring up some more. I am not a clinical person. I know you're not. You're only security. So, so may I see a clinical person that I can talk no, to? you are not allowed in here because of that phone. Nah, it ain't because, because of this because phone. Of that phone. It ain't because, because of this phone. No, you are not. That ain't what your paper said. You, you said you because of my abusive behavior. And you were see? served. For my abusive behavior. Your, your and what's my and what's my abusive out. behavior? Right, no, this so is my I protection. This. See? Know. See? You yes, sir. Outside, yes, right? sir. And I'll wait for my girl all day, all night until she come out. So when you come out here, I'll talk to you then. Don't forget you had my friend that cut hair on Venango and Kensington come out and put gloves on me. Don't worry about it. Where my old head Larry at? Yeah, tell my man, Mr. Larry, that work here. He know Larry. 
Told you. Larry was here. Larry worked at night. And Larry knew my sister. They said the cops coming. We wait. I done walked in the snow all the way over there. Knowing, that, knowing they had the situation. You, you see how the tables turn? Or they think it turn? But I've been putting my work in. Tell you, I'm going to sue the fuck out this emergency room. Yep. Trinity Health Mid Atlantic is done. Fuck it. On my 10 inch dick, told you. And I eat pussy good. Fuck it, they done. That's how confident I am. I can go around right to Dr. Richard Burger then. Told you. In fact, let's do that then. Let's do that. We're going around to my primary. Told you. They gonna follow me. Go ahead and go hit the panic button. Now I can't come in there to see my girl all because of these fuckers. Told you. <coughs> Somebody gonna have to do something. We're gonna have to get the court or something. Yeah, it's the wolf, man. I told you. Can't play no games. And my lady is in there. I ain't come yesterday right away. And me and her daughter got in a situation. So, I mean, I ain't posted on TikTok. I put it somewhere else. And yeah, we going around here with it, though. Make these pussies come around here, then. I told you. Because I'm going to show you the lady who said she had the gun. I already posted other video on TikTok, so we might as well get this video, too. Yep. You want to go home or you want to go to jail? You want to go home or you want to go to jail? You going to find out. The cops are coming. You better get the running niggas. Let me tell you one thing. You ain't never got the run if you ain't do nothing. Told you. Now I'm, I'm hurt. I'm hurt, man. Here go my primary office. See? The hospital right there. Told you. So what they gonna say? Then he say he ain't had nothing to do with them? Right. He had every right to do with them. Cause they followed me multiple times to this motherfucker. I told you. Damn, damn, she got a gun in here, so let's, let's watch our situation. I told you. Anybody could be a shooter. Yeah, we in Philly with it. We in Philly with it. Yeah, we got snakes, rats, lions. We got the whole fucking jungle. See, they come from that way and come right there. So I'm gonna stop this and continue. Uh, I'm gonna keep this rolling. This was my primary office. So December the 8th was the last time I was here on my appointment. And then December the 18th, the phone call came. And the phone call only came because two days before that, like December the 16th, it was like a Friday. We gotta go to the third floor. It was like a Friday. And they gonna hit the panic button and call them over. All right, so it was like a Friday, and I call here the X for we went for the elevator. Huh? Oh no, that's the other boy. Oh, I thought that was done. How you doing, sir? How you doing? So I called like uh, December the sixteenth, twenty twenty-three. When I called, we uh, thank you, sir. When I called, we uh. It's on me? What's that flow? So you need? Huh? No, the camera is on me? You can see me? Uh, he don't understand English, I guess. I mean, he do, but what I'm doing, he probably don't understand. All right. Oh, three. Thank you. Okay. All right. It's three. Right here. All right, so like this, December the 16th, I called the ex okay. to see if I can get some more time for my uh, caretaker. Oh, dude, the ambulance. The ambulance in that room. That's good. Mr. Richard Burke here. And when I called, I got an appointment and everything. So, that Monday, the lady in here, I'm about to take you and show you. If you see it, she called and told my girl one of the staff members in here had a gun on me. I'm going to show you the lady had the gun. 
How you doing, miss? My name, my name, my name is Walter. Is the Darcy and lady here? Um, Andrea? Yeah. Yes. Can I speak to her, please? Yep. Thank you. Let me see if she's, uh, I think she's just Let me just get, let me just get Thank you. All right, we're going to cut this part. So I'm in here. She's going to get Miss Andrea. I'm going to show you Miss Andrea. All right. It's part one, part two, part three. So I'm in my primary office. I'm going to hit this. I can tell you. All right, poison at your wolf. Got the TV on. 